The first thing I'm going to go over is the fact that once in a while you fellas may need uh, to put some kind of a voltage out to test something on a car other than direct 12 volts. We've gone over this. Any questions up to that point? There's an alternative method of testing for draws and that's using infrared diagnostics <coughs> using an infrared scanner. The prep is about the same. You do have to open up everything on the car and sometimes even more because you may want to pull the uh, panels down under the dashboard so that you can see under the dashboard. Uh, panels down from the sides of the trunk if there's modules back there. You want to look at these things. That's if you have right. to. Very, very, very simple. Cut those two wires off the BCM and connect them together. Take them off the BCM, just connect them together. You'll have up, down, just not automatic. That's all there is to it. Now, let's say, let's say this is a computer. Let's, see, let's say it's a GM computer and, and, you're, and you're sending a signal out here to the relay, fuel pump relay, all right? So it would send a signal out to the relay and then to, gr and to ground through the coil, all right? And somebody went out there because the fuel pump's bad, but they want to test it, and they go out there and they accidentally, during trying to crank the car or whatever, or they accidentally put a jumper from the positive to either ground or to the fuel pump out wire, all right? And you try cranking that car and burn out that quad driver in the PCM.